Okay, my name is Sandra Clark, all right, and I'm just going to show you some of my artwork. Um, I work in a variety of media, okay. These down here are collages, which I've based on natural forms and stems, and I've sort of shifted them around so they take a new format. Um, I like to work with trees, anything natural really, and things that have been discarded in their former lives and then I look at them again and they take on a different type of beauty or interest. So I've got a bit of paint here, um, pen and ink and a couple of different types of objects, got the tree and the stones. And here is, this is undergrowth and this is based on leaves um, and stems and I've rearranged those so it looks quite dense. Um, this one here, this is out of the earth and this is cut paper with pen and ink and pencil. This is based on trees as well, it's a repeating pattern. Um, so I put down sort of quite a rigid format there. I like trees because I often drive along the car or walk and I'm always looking at trees because they, they're nature's sculptures really, you know, I just find them fascinating. But lots of other things as well, bits and pieces, you know. I'm Paul Richmond, I come from East End, and when I first started doing art, my father was a free car trick man, so like, before doing all my work and stuff, I had to get his praise of doing art. Um, I went to St Martin's College, but before that, done uh, two years at East End College Prelim and Foundation course and then chose textile design. And then I went to South End College for three years. And this is one of my styles. Um, it's done with gouache paint. My mind thinks differently, so everything you see comes from my head. So I, um, with this particular one, I've done a washed background and then started um, working on like the sun, which is that piece there making it explode so you can get effects it's coming out so all these different characters and the filming that down the bottom strips with some of my images in it other um, style which i've got is in textile designs and that um, basically they're more easier to produce yeah and i put a lot of them in repeat and some of these i put on materials I've just lost my job and I've been quite cynical and I've painted some paintings that I think might sell. Not this one, I've had this for ages. I just like this, I put it up. This one, um, the craze, is actually me having a dig at the old East End. The, this place is full of old East Enders who go on about how lovely the East End was and how it was great and you could leave your door open and all that rubbish. But in fact it wasn't, it was a slum when it was full of white racist bigots. And these boys just about summed it up. So that's what this one's about. The one of Travis over there, the taxi driver one, was really just summed up how I felt at the moment. Uh, at the time, I just lost my job. I felt like shooting a few people. I can't shoot people, I'm not allowed, so I painted someone shooting people. So that's really what that's about. That's, <laughs> that's that. And this is just a photograph I took ages ago of like working on the seafront, and I painted it in enamel. You know, like sign writers enamels. But I'm the art, uh, creative director of the Estuary Fringe Festival, which we're going to put on in August. We let everybody in. Anybody can have a go. Last year we did one, we had gospel singers, um, we had conceptual art, we had normal stuff, you know, your, you know, what, you know, nostalgic type art. We had a huge amount of music at the railway, which was brilliant. We're doing all that again this year. Uh, well, my name is uh, John, John Bartolucci. Um, uh, this is like a new thing for me. This is the first place that I've uh, exhibited anything. And uh, I take a lot of pictures locally because um, <clears throat> I think there are a lot of uh, nice things to see in this area despite what uh, its reputation is sometimes. And uh, I like to try and find things that people might pass by or not notice and uh, take, them, take pictures of them in a different way. It's just photography. Um, so a lot of people have commented that they think that they're paintings. Um, I think that might be part of the way that they're printed. Um, uh, some of the pictures that people like are um, 
close to macro photography. It's quite close up.